So there's a there's a road bed that runs from one bank to the other. It's probably I don't know, like three foot on top right now, three to four foot. And then both of these bridges are the crossings for the creeks that ran under the road before the lake flooded. And we had a big cold front last night. We're seeing about 10 degrees colder water from what we were seeing earlier on in the week. Mm -hmm. um, so the, the fish have been pushing bait, like up on top of this road bed and stuff. So it just makes sense when it gets cold, if they're gonna have a rough day or two, that they're, they're gonna slide into that deeper water. I mean, that's, that's some of the deepest water for a long ways. I mean, this is a huge flat, and that creek channel is just intensified. Uh, it's, it's cut out under the bridge. There's a pretty significant dip there that's not, not in the creek channel running through the flat, just from, I guess, how it used to flow and how it still does flow in and out. There's one. Oh, never mind. Oh, oh do she's going to do it. Got it. Oh. Ah. She looked a lot bigger. I saw yeah. that bucket mouth open up and like, mmm. Go over top of me. About put her back. <laughs> 